Who the fuck is this? The guy keeping you out of the gas chamber. Townley's on his way. We need to talk face to face. Warehouse off Dutch London and Banning. Oh, we can do more than talk, my friend. Quit that shit, man. Yeah, I know. I take speed mostly. Look at me. Boom. Best shit. Yeah, I still take you sugar tits. That's because you're fucking deranged. Not because you're in good shape. Hey, why don't you stick with your fucking crunches and feeling bad about yourself, all right, pork chop? Hey, fuck you. Fuck. It's Caesar's place, around the corner from your house. Hi. Hi. <laughs> hey, <boy>. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Brianna. Hello. Man, the more I see of your boss, the more I like him. I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, well, look out! Well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo <laughs> for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Never flips out. Kills my family or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Okay, Let's think this can. through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working. Don't. Now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away, the FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there? Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Town. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. This is bullshit. This place, Davy. They've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve.
wrong house. Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and you... You'll barely feel a thing. I will, I will! Not the rich! I hope you're not a steer! <laughs> Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tay here. Oh. Javan. Why didn't you... Shumash. Not take coffee breaks. So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. You know, like I said, he's got his... Stop! Okay. You know, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of him. Then what? This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? Hey! I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job, no casualties. There were more eyes on that town than there needed to be. Yeah, well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh. So that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad, who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Townley. The trainees write him. It's a good exercise. Yeah, the fuck. How'd that get started? A few years ago, a letter came to the federal prison system addressed to Brad. It wasn't signed, but it gave a P.O. box in Sandy Shores. I played the part of Brad, and we started a correspondence. Yeah, thanks for telling me, Davey. I was doing you a favor. Didn't think you'd want to know he was in the same state. Yeah, so now what? I just sit back and hope he doesn't figure it out? It's worked so far. He's a time bomb, Dave, and you fucking know it. Back's bad enough, is it? This'll do. Alright. If my mama had waterboarded me more often, I wouldn't be the gun-toting psychopath you see before you now. I would pass. Please don't! Oh! It shouldn't be legal! It's torture! Oh, no! No, no! No, no! It's all in your head, Ferdinand! Don't worry! He 
he's wet, all right. Let up. Yep, he comes. I'm alive! <coughs> it was all a dream. It's a nightmare! Hey, 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 hey. Now? Huh? Now? You ready to talk? I've been ready to talk since the day I got kidnapped. You're my eyes, Townley. What do you see? We're live. You see anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? Fuck do I know? You might be an Azerbaijani for all I know. What's one look like? They look Eastern. Half this town looks Eastern, Davy. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. That ain't gonna cut it, my friend. Shit, shit, I, 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 let me think, I... Ah! Sorry, too oh, late, Trevor! Show our contestant what he's won today! Oh, okay. oh, wait, 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 wait. Sparky, Sparky! That's dangerous! You could kill me! Don't do it! Shit, please! Please! I am cooperating! when I did that? <laughs> so what have you got for us? Hmm? We need Trev to shake up your memory again? No, 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 I need eyes on that party. Pick up the scope and give me a report. Who am I looking for? Steve saying beard. What do you got? Anything specific or is some stubble gonna cut it? Let's start at Mountain Men, and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. Well, ah, there's a few beards at this party. Vinewood's full of weak chins. Place is famous for it. Damn. Beards are in fashion in Chumash. Land of beach hipsters. We need more. It's gonna be a long day until you give us some intel on our target. He's a... he's got beer. He smokes. He smokes like a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, Jim. maybe one more time, just to be sure. Oh, please, no. Huh? I told you, he, he smokes. Dentistry is an industry hasn't advanced in the last time. They'd be mining. Interrogation techniques were a little too advanced. In his heart? <gasps> I'm still here. Steve's telling me he chain smokes redwoods. It ain't the cigarettes that'll kill him. It's the guys who put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. And he's left-handed. Oh, now I get it. You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's got facial hair, a cigarette, and he's left-handed. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest, details. Ah, what the hell? That was the guy. I had a feeling. It'll check out. Well, we've... got him. It's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friend. Hey, how's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kinda. Are you gonna hold it together? I want to go home. 
I want you to see my family. No, 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 no. You have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning booth. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home. I'm taking you to the airport. You're gonna get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country, and you're gonna spread your message. I don't have a message. You're a torture advocate. Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We needed to get information to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything. Exactly. Tortures for the torturer, or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times. We should all admit that. It's useless as a means of getting information. I'm feeling lightheaded. Sometimes you torture for the torturee, but only if they're prepared to pay. I am very unwell. It's me, 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 me with you. Jesus Christ, good grief. I thought we really bonded, but now I'm having my doubts. Departures, no one driving me to the airport. Oh dear. It'll be. Where do you want to go? La Puerta! That's the ride, my man. And Trevor is... The Trevor... Trevor is a... 
Trevor is a what? Trevor is a good guy. He cried family and got kid and he flew so that, that, That's it, right, yes. Trevor? <laughs> Thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. You know where the port is? Come on then, Floyd, what you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. You're gonna have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're looking for something to steal. Sir, I stole a pencil in elementary school and I've been regretting it ever since. Floyd always was a stick in the mud. Look, sir, please, just... And I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well, looky.